propaganda is as pervasive as the air we breathe. It's a fixture in politics, advertising, social movements, all employing persuasive techniques to sway opinions and behaviors. Yet the ability to discern and critically analyze propaganda is paramount. Falling prey to its manipulations can lead us to adopt distorted worldviews. So what are the key propaganda techniques to watch out for? First, there's name calling. This technique slaps on a negative label, making the subject unacceptable without a rational argument in sight. For example, someone might be branded as un-American for holding a particular view. Then we have glittering generalities. These are vague positive phrases designed to win you over without providing any substantive facts. Think of slogans like, a brighter future awaits. Next is transfer. This method attempts to link a value or authority to the subject even when there's no inherent connection. For instance, a vitamin brand might claim it's used by Olympic athletes to bolster its reputation. Testimonials come into play when respected figures endorse ideas, even when they don't have direct expertise. A celebrity endorsing a product they know little about falls into this category. The plain folks technique tries to make you believe that the spokesperson is an ordinary person just like you, even when they might not be. Farmer Joe's speaking for a multinational agricultural corporation is a classic example. Lastly, card stacking involves cherry-picking facts that support the argument while conveniently omitting contradictory data. Now how do you critically analyze these techniques? Stay alert for emotional language aimed to stir feelings of fear or anger rather than inform. Scrutinize the source for potential biases, agendas, or conflicts of interest. Look for one-sided arguments that don't fairly address or acknowledge counter-arguments. Question whether core assumptions are solidly backed by credible evidence or academic consensus. Identify logical fallacies such as ad hominems, false causes, and hasty generalizations. Be wary of misleading use of data and statistics that present an incomplete or distorted picture. And always check if alternative perspectives or evidence that undermine the narrative are being dismissed or ignored. Remember, no single source is entirely objective or comprehensive. Consulting a variety of sources across the political or ideological spectrum is essential to achieving balance. Cross-check claims against other credible authoritative sources to verify accuracy. And avoid insular echo chambers that only serve to reinforce set beliefs without outside scrutiny. In conclusion, in our interconnected world, being able to detect and counteract propaganda's deceptive tactics is indispensable. By exercising rational critical thinking, scrutinizing sources, arguments, and evidence impartially, we can immunize ourselves against manipulation. But it requires diligence to pierce through propaganda's distortions and objectively evaluate information. The consequences of accepting falsehoods or half-truths blindly are too severe. The pursuit of truth, while arduous, is a necessity for society.